Now at five, could your toothpaste be linked to unhealthy side effects? CBS 46's Sabrina Silva tells us about the ingredients you should stay away from when trying to keep your mouth clean. Though masks are coming back on, it's still a good idea to keep track of what's going on with our oral health. And let's be honest here, when was the last time you went down a toothpaste aisle and actually looked at what you're putting in your mouth? For dentist Dr. Flores Day, we should all be paying close attention to the ingredients. It is all about ingredients. Certain ingredients are fluff just for marketing purposes. Other ingredients are needed to help you have a healthy mouth. Dr. Stay says there are several ingredients that you'll see in most of the oral health items on the shelves that you should stay away from. First on the list, alcohol. She says it dries the mouth, which encourages bacteria to thrive. SLS that can promote canker sores in people who are sensitive to it, gluten, formaldehyde, essential oils like tea tree oil, which is an antifungal ingredient, and get this, even mint. Mint which is in about 98% of toothpaste, dermatologists list as one of the top allergens. But people wouldn't know why they're getting rashes around their mouth. So what should you look for instead? Xylitol is a wonderful replacement for your fluoride toothpaste. Baking soda is excellent because it helps neutralize acids in the mouth. And acids are what, what attack the teeth. Aside from always looking at the label, Dr. Stay says it's important to listen to your dentist. Our mouths are all different, so what we need to protect our oral health is different as well. In Atlanta, I'm Sabrina Silva, CBS 46 News.